Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can disable or enable Windows Defender on your Windows 11 operating system. So Microsoft Defender Antivirus is the default antivirus malware solution to protect your computer from unwanted viruses, ransomwares, spywares or other form of uh, malware or hackers, right? But in some situations, you may need to permanently or temporarily disable this uh, Microsoft Defender antivirus protection. So let me show you how you can uh, disable or enable this uh, Microsoft Defender. You can open the settings app by clicking on the search icon and then searching for the settings app here. And once settings app uh, result uh, appears, you just need to click on the settings app. Now in the settings app, you need to click on the privacy and security option and then click on windows security option. Once this uh, windows security window opens, you will be able to see this first option here, which says virus and threat protection. Just click on this. It's going to open the other window. And here you can click on quick scan to scan for uh, the current threats on your computer. And when you will scroll down here, you will be able to see this option which says manage settings under virus and threat protection settings, right? So you just need to click on manage settings here. And then this is the option which you want to enable or disable for the Microsoft Defender antivirus right so let me maximize this window here in order to disable microsoft defender you just need to toggle this toggle button and then click on yes which is going to toggle this toggle button to off which means that your microsoft defender is disabled now and now this option will be disabled until the next restart so if you want to install any software you can install it before the restart of this computer and in the next restart it's going to be enabled by default when you restart your computer right so this is how you can enable or disable the microsoft defender antivirus on your windows 11 operating system now earlier it used to be possible to permanently disable this option using the registry editor or with the other options also but now microsoft has made it very difficult to change this option permanently so this is the only option available right now and i will update this video once i find the solution for permanently disabling or enabling the windows defender so that's it for this video i hope you've enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next video